earlier, earlier in the debate, um, my opponents claimed that uh, low recruitment corresponded, uh, recruitment was lower in, I believe, 1980, 1998 and uh, 1999 when unemployment was low. Um, the correlation between um, low recruitment and uh, low, low unemployment shows that people do not want to be in the army. So if our, uh, if our, do not want to be in the military. So if our army, or if our military, uh, is a volunteer-based or uh, and, uh, is a volunteer-based organization, um, people don't want to be in it. They will not volunteer. The system is will fail. Um, they, were, they also claimed that. Um, they also had claims that the Army was having uh, better retention at this point. Um, Tom, Tom Shanker from the New York Times reported that in 2005, more than a third of the West Point class of 2007 left that active duty at the earliest, point, at the er at the earliest possible moment after completing <coughs> their five-year obligation. Um, also, um, I have information here. Uh, well, anyway, that that uh, particular point, or uh, that shows that people may be staying in, but not the higher ups. In fact, the people, the or what's it? I have it. Um, oh yes, um, in October of 2007. Um, oh, of the 6,434 enlistees who signed up in October 2007, uh, 792, 12.3% uh, requi uh, required waivers for past criminal activity that would have disqualified them, including misdemeanor and felony convictions. Um, this shows that um, the higher-ups are leaving and why wouldn't someone with criminal and felony con uh, convictions want to stay in the Army? Uh, honestly, is there that much better things out there that would accept someone with those sorts of credentials? Um, also, <coughs> my opponents claim that having a draft would raise, the, uh, would raise the cost of the Army by $4 billion. As I mentioned before, the uh, military's budget is approximately $3 billion. Um, in 2007, it was 2.9 or 2.799 trillion uh, in, two point, in 2008 it jumped to uh, 2.941 trillion. Um, Four billion is a little bit over one percent of that, and it jumped by it from 07 to 08 by uh, gosh, it looks like almost 200 it almost by 200 million. So by 200 billion. So 4 billion is really not a significant increase to the uh, to the uh, cost of the army. Um, and as my my opponent uh, claimed that there was only 2% of lower <coughs> level uh, I'm assuming with the cap fours um, in sep uh, September of 2005, as I said before, the Department of Defense released uh, Instruction 1145, which allowed that to increase to 4%. So, and it actually increased to, uh, after that was released to about 12%. Uh, that may have come down since then because that's a little bit dated, but um, this concludes my argument and rebuttal. Uh, description. Description. Uh, description.